Hello guys, I'm Lucinel and welcome back to another video, I, I guess, um, what, what do they call this? Yeah, playing Scape Chasm 2. I guess that's what I should have said at the beginning. Okay, take two. Hello guys, I'm Lucinel and welcome to Escaped Chasm 2. Uh, we played Escaped Chasm a while ago, if you remember. So let's go ahead and play uh, the sequel, apparently. It was here in the extras folder. So uh, let's see what's up with it. Just... There's no, uh, there's no sound. Did I install this properly? Hold on. Let me lower as usual the, the sound, cause it's usually pretty loud. Let's do start. Wow. That's... <laughs> That's it? <laughs> That's it. Okay, that needs to become a meme. <laughs> this needs to become a meme. So anyway, uh, we're not playing Escape Chasm 2. Escape Chasm 2 is a, a joke. Does anything happen at the end, or...? It's gonna stay here for a bit. I just thought it would be something funny to check out before we actually get into the, the, the game that we're playing. I guess it just loops. Does it...? I was gonna, I was gonna assume it just loops. Okay, <laughs> so yeah, that, it's Escape Chasm 2. Uh, now, for the actual... Well, we're actually playing... Hello guys, I'm Lucinel and welcome to Dweller's Empty Path. So this is the actual Scaped Chasm 2. It's not Scaped Chasm 2 because it's not really, it's like a whole new thing. It's, I imagine it's related to the world that uh, we saw our protagonist go into at the end of the uh, of Scaped Chasm. Uh, as you can see, let me lower the sound a little bit just in case. I'll just lower everything to 80%. So yeah, as you can see, this is one of the characters that she was dreaming about. So I wonder if this will answer some of the questions that were left uh, unanswered in Escape Chasm. I'm hoping it will. But we'll see. Anyway, guys, let's keep it going. Let's keep it moving. Or let's start it up, I guess. <laughs> Enjoy! Alright. Also, this is a very small screen. I wonder... Oh, I can make it full screen. Okay. M my head. It hurts. All of these voices and... All of these faces are floating into my head. Who are they? Ah, it feels like my head's gonna burst open. Someone, make it stop. Ooh, wait, that's the eye from the from the TV which we saw in Escape Chasm. Oh, whoa. Oh, wow. This is even more pixelated. What the heck? What's up? Another nightmare. I've been getting a lot of these lately. Huh. I have a feeling he's behind this one again. Hmm. I don't think I can fall back asleep after that. Well, no use laying around in bed. Huh. Oh. There she is. Guess I'll go for a walk to clear my mind a bit. Okay, yeah, so, wow, it's even more pixelated, right? I feel like there's even more, even even more pixels or less pixels technically. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> so yeah, I know that now, this is a way longer game, so it will probably take a couple of episodes to get through it. But you know, we'll take it easy. Oh, I forget about these apples I left here. They still seem good. I'll eat one later though. Okay, living somewhere that's very fresh or something. I don't need to change clothes. What I'm wearing right now is fine. It's not like I have much variety anyway. Maybe I should pick up some new clothes sometime in town. In town, okay. Maybe writing a journal might help take my mind of things. Do I record stuff? Not yet. Don't have to, yeah, don't have too much to write about anyway. Okay, can I go down here? Oh, interesting. Sounds out, it's the bread right now to use my lamp. Interesting, whoa. Transition is weird. Whoa, wait, 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 what was that? Did I? Oh, I thought I saw someone when I entered the room. For some reason. Spare wardrobe, because I'm on my old clothes and Claire's outfits mixed in there. Who's Claire? Uh, let's see, this is the, the attic? The, no, the, the attic or the... Hello? Are you... Yo, good morning, Yoki. Are you awake kind of early? Good morning, Claire. Claire, there you go. It is pretty early, huh? I haven't been sleeping all that well lately. Mm, yeah, you don't look so great these days. Was it another nightmare? Yeah, I've been getting them a lot more recently. I can't remember the last time I got a... F a good full night's rest. This one was especially draining. I feel beyond exhausted. Hmm. 
You know. What's up? <laughs> I'm thinking. It was. Whoops. Didn't read that. You know, Zara. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Usually with his nightmares, they end up with some kind of eye looking back at me. I was also thinking it was him because I saw him by the front door earlier. Ah, there's no doubt about it then. It was him. His nightmares feel much more aggressive lately. Wonder if he's mad at me. So some guy is giving you... And what's with that guy? Yeah, <laughs> right? Why is he so fixated on you? Think he's got a crush? I don't think it's that. Well, whatever it is. Seriously, be careful around him. If I could get rid of him myself, I totally would. I put up so many spell barriers around the house. And he just comes in and breaks them like it was nothing. Hmm. Don't worry about me. If it ever came down to it, if he ever tried anything, I can take care of myself. Not scared of him. He's already giving you nightmares, though. <laughs> She'll really take care of him, you know, now. Like, just beat him up. Oh, you're so cool. After all, it's not like he's ever tricked you or roped you into these schemes before. His schemes before. Is that the guy that was in the in, in our game? In, in our game. In our... He was like the observer or whatever. Was that him? What is this? Wanted... <laughs> what? I like that picture of me, so I decided to keep that one. <laughs> wow. Fair enough. I mean... There's latest works. What a strong smell. Wanna try it? No, thank you. I wish you would have the option to try it, and something like funny will, will happen if you try it. Hey, hey, that's my journal. I don't go looking through your stuff without your permission. I'm pretty sure you do. Well, maybe. Don't look through me. My stuff is cursed. You'll be haunted. By who? By me, of course. You're right. I wouldn't want it. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Why, also, why is there wind in here? Is the the cauldron creating some type of wind? Like, I'm assuming there's wind, right? That's why it's moving. Let's see what's in the fridge. Which is pretty empty. She'll do some shopping in the village soon. Yeah. Okay, so th this is the house that we see from the protagonist's perspective of Escape Chasm. I forgot if she has a name. Sorry about the face cam again. <laughs> if, I, if I get too into the story, I'm gonna forget. I have so many unpleasant stores, stories involving this thing. <laughs> the stove? Really? Or are we gonna just leave? Ooh. And so we have left, and apparently we are giant. Oh, this actually doesn't really look like the house. Well, Tammy did say that it was a direct sequel, so I don't know. Mm. Vegetables, me and Claire have been growing. I wonder if maybe this is like a prequel? Maybe up here is the village? Oh, what the, who the heck are you? Hello? Is this an enemy? Oh, it's you. I've known you since you were very little. I've been watching you over the years. You've grown so much. You look so much more tasty. I think I remember you. I don't recall you ever wanted to eat me, though. I thought you were a more peaceful beast type. I am peaceful. I won't eat anything that's alive. I only eat what's already dead. Ah, so you're a scavenger. This is not the, the girl, right? Kinda looks like her, but it's hard to tell because of the pixel art. I've been waiting for you today ever since I had laid my eyes on you. I can't wait for that day. That looks so enthusiastic. Okay. Oh, another tree stump. Anything else that I can do? Oh, wait, what? Oh, I can look. Oh, I can look from the cliff. Is that the village? Okay. <laughs> like, I'm just looking over at the... Okay, the town from there. Oh, hello? Wait, is this the dude? Wait, did I ignore them? Were they here before? Of course, you're here, Zara. You don't look so happy to see me. I'm never happy to see you. This is, this is him, yeah. Oh, so mean. So... What is it? Why are you here? I'm just dropping by to visit my favorite forest resident. And what else? That's all. Hmm. Okay. I don't buy that for a second. You planted that nightmare I had last night in my head, right? Don't give the silent treatment. You don't want me to be useful for your plans and such, right? Would I really be any of use to you when I'm this fatigued? What's the point of doing this? It's my way of showing I care for you. Maybe you should care a little bit less. <laughs> I mean, fair enough. Yeah, little chick. Chirp, chirp. Are you feeling lost? Confused? I'm here to help. Would you like a hint? No, not yet. Thank you. The fox. Hello. Um, are we gonna, are we gonna fight or something? Wait, is it gonna look where I'm looking? Oh, that's funny. It's cute. Can I talk with it again? Oh no, it just bounces. Okay. Uh, another house over here? Yeah, there's a. Whoa. Maybe not. There's a mailbox here. Nothing to deliver today. What is this? A rabbit hole? Oh. Oh. Hi. Oh. <laughs> oh, yucky. You came to visit me. What a surprise. Hello, hello. Hi, Mattel. Hello. 
see you're in the middle of repairs right now. Yeah, I've been at it all day. Oh, did you damage your arm? What happened? I got into a fight with a beast type earlier. I'm not really sure what I did to upset her. I don't think I can do anything unusual. I was just minding my own business. Next thing I knew, she charged right at me and tortured my arm. My mechanical arm got damaged a bit, but it's nothing the best mechanic in the whole kingdom can't fix. It's a shame Claire's potions don't work on you. Otherwise, I'd go and grab one for you. Well, why does it need work? Is she like a robot or something? Even if they did work on me, there's no way I'd take it. And when Harry should throw in poison just to spite me. I don't think she'd go that far. <laughs> oh, maybe she would. <laughs> I wish she would. Next time I see her, I'll give her a piece of my mind. I really don't think she'd upset the beast type. If anyone agitated the beast type, don't you think it'd be Sarah? Yeah. Oh, I guess so. Guess I've been seeing him around more lately. Maybe she'll give him a piece of your mind instead. No way. Zara's really scary. Tell me about it. But I haven't told that energy from earlier. I know. It's fun. I like her. Seems to be a manual for various machines. Did she write this herself? Uh, aim, 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 models, aim, models, aim, models, aim, models, bed. The bed is hard as rock. Also, there's a charging cable attached to it. Oh, so she is a robot. Do you really think that... Do you, do you really... <laughs> you, you could... You do... Do you really think Zara would agitate that beast type? If it was anyone, it'd be him, right? Maybe. But why will he do that? He only ever focuses on you. I guess you're right. So if it wasn't Zara, it was definitely Claire. You're just looking for a reason to blame Claire, huh? <laughs> wonder if it really was Zara. These types have been unusually active lately. Maybe. Maybe he's been giving them nightmares too? Are there veggies here, by the way? Aren't these vegetables from my garden? <laughs> Did you steal them? What? Can I talk with her again? Last time we had a run in with the beast type, Claire said, This is so annoying. You can help me with this, right? And without waiting for me to answer, she just flew off. She left me to fend off the beast type all by myself. I barely made it out of that scrap alive. She's the worst. Now that sounds like her. <laughs> Yeah, I, I mean, I can't believe it. Alright, that's it, I guess. Boxes of what looks like spare parts. I guess her mechanical arm needs a lot of maintenance. Oh, okay, she has a mechanical arm. She's not actually a, a robot. Uh, hello? Oh, all of these animals do the same thing? Is this also a hint? Hint chirp chirp? Oh, no, it's just a normal chirp chirp. Okay. Uh, anything of interest here? Like a prince butterfly? Oh. Oh. That's a cute little moment. Wish it was... Had a little bit more movement. I feel pleasant. Oh. Uh, so is the town over there? I'm, I'm assuming. Let's. Oh, actually, we can move faster. I forgot. If I hold shift, we can move faster. I wonder if. Like, where, where are these holes? I thought it was from the where we were planting the the plant the plants the the vegetables. But I guess maybe not. I don't know. Maybe this is the way for the village. I usually do that. I I think that something is like the main road, and I f I know I don't know. This feels kind of main roady, rather than the other areas. Maybe I should go back. I don't know. I, ne I never know what to do, honestly. <laughs> okay, there's a way down here. Oh, where are you? Hello? It's strange. No matter how far I walk, it's like I'm going around in circles. Rumor has it that this forecast has been enchanted by a witch. This forest? This Did I say this forecast? All who enter the forest lose their way. I guess the rumors are true. I'm lost too. I guess he's talking about Clara's barrier. The barrier only activates if strangers get too close to our house. Though, the barrier should be broken at the moment. I guess it's still in effect enough to make some people lose their way. Are... are you not affected by the enchantment... enchanted forest? You think you could help me get out of here? I've been looking for the nearby village. I mean, if you're talking about something making everyone lost and then you meet someone who is not, who happens to not be lost, I wouldn't... I wouldn't trust that, you know? You know what I'm saying? You, know, you, know, you catch my drift. Um, I can help them out, sure. I mean, I don't know where it is either, but okay. Try not to stray too far away from me. What a relief to come across someone so kind. Down here or over there? What, what is up here? Every time I go a different way. Oh, I should probably, yeah, go a little bit faster. Uh, there is a way over here. What is over here? I guess it's just like some type of extra area that you don't really need to... Oh, there is something down here, right? So is it kind of goes? It's a little bit overwhelming. Uh, hello? What's up with you guys? That's strange. I can't, I can't sense a fountain anywhere. Fountain? Mountain. Are you guys lost? We are pretty deep in the forest. Nope, we're doing just fine. Are you sure? We're pretty far away from anywhere. Yep. Yeah, are you sure? 
Um, all right, I guess they are lost. Are we just gonna leave them there? <laughs> Imagine we make our party, but instead of it being like an actual like battle party, it's just people that we need to help them find a way, <laughs> find a way home. Uh, what's up? I'm all. Oh, the traveler found them all. I ran away. Okay. Good job, dude. Is it this way? Well, they, they said we're pretty deep in the forest, so I don't think this is the way. What is what is going on here? Can I? Oh, someone's been here recently. What a peculiar tree stump. Surely someone comes by here often. Yeah, I know someone who does. Someone who likes to come here and spar with me once in a while. That's so. Okay, so I guess maybe... Yeah, th these are just like extra areas. But I imagine they're not that... You know, they're, they're not obligatory to to go through. Uh, let's just keep going. See if we can find our way to the to the village. Yeah, down, down here, right? Or oh, maybe not. Yeah, okay. Uh, what's up, guys? This looks a little rough. Let's turn around. I agree. Yeah, it's like wolves fighting a fox or something. Yeah, this uh, force of nature or something. Ooh, what is this? This this sure is a sign I can't read from over here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, geez, you didn't have to be so <laughs> passive aggressive about it. Left to village, right to castle town. Okay, well, we're trying to go to the village, so I'm assuming we should go to we should go that way, right? Maybe at some other point we'll be able to go to Castle Town. Warning, beast type territory ahead. Good thing we didn't run into any beast types. I'd have been a gunner for sure. Yeah, we were really lucky. Maybe you've been affected by the barrier was for the best. Yeah, probably. What about this? Village. Oh, south. Okay. Let's keep going south then. I mean, it's the only way we can go, I think. There we go. Ah, this will be fine. There we go. Yeah, I mean, you see the village. Thank you so much for helping me out of the forest. Your thing? I wonder how he got so deep into the forest. Did he not notice any of the signs? I wonder if Zara had anything to do with it. Maybe? He does feel like the type of guy that, yeah, everything is related to him. What's up? How did my journal end up here? Did I record stuff? Oh, okay. Yeah, let's save. Uh, I did see that some people were having trouble with uh, saving. So I hope I don't stumble upon those problems. Oh, well, the villagers like to make wishes at this one. I wonder if any of them come true. Maybe I should try it. What's up? You look like a bundle rabbit from Animal Crossing. My mommy told me to stay away from you. She said you were actually a scary beast type in disguise. You're not gonna eat me, right? Don't worry, I won't do that. <laughs> What's up? I was here when you took down that beast type that stormed into the village. It was appreciated, but a lot of us didn't know if you were a beast type. To be honest, I was also scared of you until recently. But after you started working at the post office and coming by often, I realized you were pretty alright. Oh, okay, so we work at the post office. That's good uh, info to have. Oh, hello. Just broke into someone's house, I guess. Uh, hello, what are you doing in my home? Oh, um... <laughs> That's it? That's it? That's it? Okay. <laughs> can I can I cook something for you? Since, you know... There's a really tasty smell coming from the oven. Are we all gonna eat their food? I, I'm just gonna leave you alone. It's like you, I'm sorry. Uh, is this the post office? It looks like a shop. Oh, it's like a restaurant. Okay. Hello? Anyone here? Hey, is that Yokia here? Oh, hey. What's up? Fo Sorry, I was handling some stuff in the back. How are you? I'm alright, I'm just taking a small walk. Oh, you don't look so great to me. Well, actually, I guess I've been better. Thought so. I can't fool these sharp eyes. Tell me, what's been on your mind? It's a little tough to explain. As you say, I haven't been getting much sleep these days. Hmm, I see. Well, how about get you some nice hot tea? My treat. So that you could use it. Thanks, Kaina. That sounds great. Yo, yo, yo. She's, she's, she's pretty great. She's pretty great. Ki Kaina is her name? So, besides bad sleep, what else has been going on in your life? Work's been pretty busy. These types have been very active lately. Feels like the prince has a, has a new job for me every other day. Oh, I see. Man, I remember the days I used to work for the crown. The crown? Is that the name of the prince or the royal family? Those were some rough times. Glad to leave it all behind me. Yeah, I can't imagine what it must have been like to work as a mercenary. You get your hands tied up in some pretty messy situations. How about you though? You handle situations with beast steps, right? Can't imagine that work being too pleasant either. It's not so bad. Calming them down when they're on a rampage isn't too hard for me. The prince can get pretty upset if I let them free afterwards though. Yeah. <laughs> Just like you. You're the only one I know who'd, been so, who'd be so cool in dealing with beast types. I'm sure anyone else will take being a mercenary over the work you deal with. 
Oh, I guess you've got that odd power that seems to knock them the right out. Yeah, though, I don't, I don't like relying on that power so much. I'd rather deal with them without using this power that I don't understand. Yeah, I get ya. Well, speaking of which, I keep changing her voice, I'm sorry. I've been feeling pretty stiff lately, and business is a bit slow at the moment. Wanna head to the forest and spar for a bit? Oh, is she the one she spars with? Nice. I'm running to stretch my arms and legs a bit. Sure thing! How about we meet up at our old sparring spot? That old tree stump? Sounds good, I'll meet you there. Whoa. What are these? Found missing journal pages. What? Suddenly we just found it? Or did we... Oh, 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 maybe that's for the... Like in Escape Chasm, like at the end of the game we can stumble upon a secret room or something. Where we have those... Those journal pages. Interesting, interesting. I will say I love games that reward you for exploring. Because, you know, it takes time to go around and actually look into every house and everything. So it's pretty appreciated that you get uh, extra content from that. I just moved here from the castle town that's a bit of a distance from here. I'm waiting for some things to arrive in the mail that my family is sending over. They sure are taking their time. I see. There's some boxes underneath the bed, though. Yeah, I guess they just moved here. So, um, I just got into your house, I guess. Thing seems like it's in working condition. I feel like I shouldn't look through other people's fridges. Yeah, it's probably probably not ideal. Oh, it's a delivery girl. You've been doing a great job. Before you used to deliver the mail, it used to be Esther, but we'd always have our mail at weird hours and it will be several hours late. Or it will be several hours late. It's so much better now that you deliver everything. Thank you. I think he tries his best though. With how spacey Esther can be, I can't imagine anyone ever cut their mail. Oh, I see. <laughs> Uh, what is this? Is this the postal service? Oh, maybe. Hello? Oh. Hey, boss. This is Esther? Um... <laughs> um... Hey, Esther? 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 East? I don't know. Oh, hello. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. I didn't notice you walked in. No worries, I'm a bit out of it myself. Though he's always like this. Hey, now that you're here, there's some mail that's been piling up. Can you get around to sending them out? Uh, I'm not actually... I didn't come here for work. Yeah, sure thing. I'm not scheduled today, though. I'll still get paid, right? Oh, wow. Well. Hey, he zoned out again. Did he, or is he just ignoring that? <laughs> Did he just ignore what you were saying? Looks like there are letters to be sent out today. Guess I'll go deliver this to the village. They're the delivered guest. Oh, so that's why we we can go into people's houses. I'm 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 assuming anyway. <laughs> I imagine we're going to the the houses. Oh, is this for me? Yeah, I'm here to deliver this. Oh, nice. Thank you. I've been waiting forever for these. You're welcome. I hope you like the village. I definitely will if everyone here is as kind as you. One down, two to go. Okay. We gotta deliver a letter to Kairi? K Kair? K I don't remember her name. Whoops. Let's go. Yeah, it's the girl that we broke into her house. <laughs> oh, hello. Why are you in my home? Oh, do you have my mail? I do. Thank you so much. Sure thing. There we go. One more to go. Let's go. Uh, is there another house or is it here? Okay, I guess it's not here. Then where? Oh, what is this? Carriage service ahead. Interesting. Oh, that this house down here. Okay, probably it. Have I gone into this house? I thought I did, but maybe I didn't. Hold on. Oh, yeah, I, I don't think I have. Okay. Hello. Hello, deliver girl. Hello, I have some letters to deliver. <laughs> well, of course. Thanks so much. I've been waiting on this. No problem. Hmm. Looks like all the letters have been delivered. I shall head back to the post office. Nice. Let me, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll be quick, though. I'll check your attic. Oh, hello. Oh, is this a man? Oh, I'm bit. Thanks for helping me out of the forest earlier. I think sometime tomorrow, I want to try to find the lakefront I, I grew up You're from around here? Yes, I am, in fact. I grew up in the castle town that's a bit of a bit away from here. Though, it's been so long since I've been back there. It seems I've forgotten all the routes I used to know there. Or here, actually. Well, if you find me tomorrow, I can take you there if you'd like. Oh, I'd really appreciate that. What a kind person you are. No problem, I guess. <laughs> okay, let's keep it going. Let's, uh, so go back to the postal office, did they say? Oh. Um. Isn't here. I guess he went out for a bit. There's something left on the desk here. It's money! And a note? I went out for a bit. Here's something for your time. Thanks for the hard work, East. 
East or Est? I don't know. There's double mutual pay here. Thanks, East. Oh. Okay, so he is nice. <laughs> I, I thought it was just ignoring her, honestly. If you walk west, you'll hit the kingdom's border. I've never gone that far. Kinda curious what the next kingdom over is like. I'd like to travel out again soon. Though the prince throws a fit whenever he finds out I live. Hmm. Some freshly picked food is being sold here. Those apples look really tasty. You already have apples in your home, though. Uh. Okay. Dot dot dot, I guess. My mom wanted me to pick up some stuff from the market. But I don't remember what I was supposed to get. There's some freshly looking fruit being sold here. I'll come by another time to buy some. Yeah, you have fruit, you have fruit at home. Uh, so what's our next objective? East was never afraid of you. He even gave you a job after you came back from the castle. East is a really nice guy. He's just not so organized or time efficient. <laughs> I see. Yeah, I guess he does space out a while, huh? Uh, what's over here? Uh, something shrine ahead? The two, the two signs to fade it to read. The two sign? What? The, si the sign, right? The sign's to... I don't know. <laughs> the large dragon statue seems to be covered in moss and vines. Hmm. Whoa. The heck is this? Crumbling statue of a forgotten de deity of some sort. This has been here for as long as I can remember. But I don't think I've ever actually seen anyone come here or talk about it. I wonder what this statue is all about. It looks like a dragon. Oh. I that east? No. Right? Who was that? Oh, it wasn't east. Okay. So I just took this road. I don't know. Is this like gonna be the edge of the kingdom or something? I wish there was a way to fast travel at some point. This path borders another kingdom. Probably should adventure too far out. I don't really have a reason to. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> Understandable. This reminds me a little bit, uh, in that regard at least, to uh, Octopath Traveler. Yeah, another RPG I would love to play at some point. Um, because I actually played uh, long ago, I played the demo, and it seemed really, really fun. So I would love to check it out. Oh, wait, are they... who is this? How did the journal get here? Is this East, or who is this? Oh, here's where you went with work today. If you want, I can fly you back up the mountain. Uh, not right now. Uh, I want to see if we can find the, the guy, but if we can't find them anywhere, yeah, I guess we'll go back to the mountain. Uh, this is not the... Oh, I saw someone with a very peculiar presence just walk by. Wonder where he was up to. Ooh, did you see them, Fox, Fox Girl? I remember when the rest of the. Okay, never mind. This is not related. Sorry, this is not related. L let me ask this girl if she saw anyone. Apparently, they never, right? Other villagers here feel the, feel the same. What? Apparently, they never about what? The, the mail? Oh, maybe we should go to Spar on the forest, right? We we're talking about that. Oh, what's over here? Fair service ahead. Let, let's see if they are over here. The peak is... Oh, is this you? Heading over to the castle? Want to lift? Uh, not right now. I'm all right for now. Oh, okay. Sorry, I just keep seeing white hair people and I, th <laughs> I think they are the, the, the person we saw. Let me go back up towards the stump is. See if we can spar with the girl. And uh, maybe that's where we'll leave the episode for now. So it's been interesting so far. Definitely some type of mystery going on that I'm interested to see what's it all about. Uh, this way, right? No, the upper. I'll say that the forest is a little bit tedious to navigate. I guess, you know, that there's not much to do. If there was more stuff to do... Oh, hi. Cow. Hello. <laughs> if there was more to do, it will be even cooler. Moo. I don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> uh, this way, right? Maybe? Maybe not? Yes, right? I think? Yeah. Is it here? Oh yeah, here's the stump, but they're not- Oh! Never mind! Sheesh! Sheesh, that actually scared me. <laughs> Damn. Ha! <laughs> ah. <laughs> not bad, kiddo. <laughs> not bad. After all this time, still strong as ever. I could say the same for you. Yo, 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 yo. Ooh, what a workout! I haven't felt that adrenaline in ages. Forgot what it felt like to spar with you. To spar with you. Yeah, that was fun. I miss getting to train with you regularly. But if it means never having to draw my dagger ever again, I don't mind this being an occasional treat. Yeah, I still remember when you used to train with me at the castle. It was so hard to beat you back then. And look at you now, kicking my butt like nobody's business. Training with you back then sure was a highlight during my time at the castle. Hard to believe I used to be so wary of you when you first showed up. Better about back then. No worries, I'm usually a bit of pudding at first. Anyway, it seems like things worked out pretty nicely for you afterwards. 
seem a lot happier these days working at the at your cafe. One of the best decisions I ever made. Are you two gonna side job too? Let's stay at the post office, right? Este is again I ate. Sorry. Let me know, please. I'd honestly say my work at the castle is my side job, actually. If I could, I'd just solely work at the post office. But the prince wants to keep me under surveillance. I'd say he has your work at the castle for access to that power of yours. Well, yes, that's part of it too. I think the third part of it all is that he's pretty lonely. Well, just take care of yourself, alright? What do you mean? Where did you... where did that come from? I'm saying I don't trust the crown. If you mean the prince, I think you might have the wrong idea about him. Besides, you didn't trust me at first either, right? This is different. You haven't seen what I've seen. There's a reason I quit my work and ran off, you know. Hmm. Well, never mind. You're pretty strong. You'll be able to handle whatever comes your way. Since the prince likes you, I bet he won't let you see anything too messy. I wonder what kind of Kaina? 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 Kaina saw that make her quit working at the castle. Oh well. If she dislikes the prince this much, I can't imagine what she'd think of Zara. <laughs> yeah, honestly. Anyway, I'm gonna head back to the cafe now. Feel free to stop by again anytime you like. To the, to the cafe, right? Not, not here. You're not gonna come back here. Okay, so I'll go back to the house. Uh, I'll save there. And yeah, believe the episode there. Yeah, but it's been fun so far. Let me know what you guys think so far. Uh, again, it feels like there's... Much like any RPG, you know, it's all about the... It's starting to build up, I feel like. We're starting to know the relationships in, to the characters and... I guess some, cert, some, some type of mystery, maybe? Like, some, some stuff that might get answered at some point. Or maybe not, but, because th this game, like, you know, is, is not super long either. But, uh, yeah, it's got a fair amount of... I mean, it's way bigger than Escape Chasm, for sure. That's definitely very commendable. So, uh, oh, actually, I'm, I'm going back. Yeah, can you... Yeah, fly me back, please. Yes. Sure, I appreciate that. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Thank you. Want me to fly you down the mountain? Oh, that's dope. Okay. Uh, hello. Hello. Good. So, uh, yeah, next time we'll do more exploration. For now, I'll just uh, go into my room, save up, and... I don't know, maybe we can go to bed or something? Let me... Let me save on file 3, just in case anything messed up or anything. Uh, yeah, go to sleep. Still feeling a little restless. Did I really... Yeah. I walked around enough. Hopefully it was enough for me to get some better sleep. Oh, okay. Actually, let's end this here. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, that, does that end the game? Oh, okay. I'm assuming there's still a lot of stuff to do, right? End. Oh, she's like, not, yeah, not rest, restful enough. Okay, at least we can load from other part. Yeah, we can continue from other things. So, okay, <laughs> gonna leave the episode right here, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. And, uh, yeah, it's gonna be it for now. Uh, let me know if you wanted to continue this. And also, for those who made it all the way here, first, thank you, thank you, thanks a lot. And, uh, I would like to know, I wanna know if you guys will be interested in watching uh, me play a game that I've been looking into called um, Omori. So yeah, apparently, you know, it's, it's very much an RPG, much, much like Undertale, you know, inspired by, by Earthbound, by the, the old school RPGs, and it, it visually looks pretty cool, like pretty unique. So yeah, I would love to check it out at some point. I'm, I'm really interested. But uh, let me know if you guys will, will like to see it. And yeah, it's gonna be it. Once again, I'm Bozinel, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. So this is coming up on a Tuesday, I think. So yeah, have a great rest of the week.